Flying the FPV is a really fun and immersive experience, but let's be honest, if you're like me and wear glasses, putting these goggles on and off can be a hassle or just downright cumbersome. But what if there was a way I can just get rid of these glasses altogether? Well today that's possible with these Hans VR lenses. So let's take a look at these and see how they work. So here are the boxes right here and these things look really nice. Nice presentation with a flat or matte black finish and the Hans VR logo on here. Almost like a gift box like for Christmas or something. So that's pretty cool. As you see here, I have two boxes here. I have one set of lens here for my DJI Goggles V2 and I have a second set of lens here for my DJI Goggles 2. So yes, they actually do make lenses for the new DJI Goggles. In fact, they actually make lenses for other consumer products like the Oculus Quest 2 and the PlayStation VR. So they have you covered in that department as well. I'll leave those links down below so you can take a look at it. So let's open these up and see what's inside. Cool, and as you can see, we have a microfiber cleaning cloth here for VR lenses. This thing is really nice. It's like a, it's so fancy guys. And here it is, Hans VR, and it's in a pouch guys. Really cool that they actually did that. I mean, they could have just put it in here. So let's open this up and see what's inside. All right, here's your VR lens adapter. So that's probably one of the lens. A second lens for left and right. And you have this nice carrying case. All right, so let's take a look at these lenses. And as you can see, we have both left and right so you don't get them confused. So let's take a look at the first one here. Get that out, really nice. Looks like some kind of composite material, which is good because this thing is super light, guys. In fact, it's actually a left on here. And I'm assuming there's gonna be a right on this one as well. So you can't really mistake them. See if that's true. Yep, I'm correct. Now you can get this in a couple of options. Obviously these are made or tailored to your specific prescription. So there's none of that, you know, hunting or there's a prescription between the two. No, these are your exact prescription. These things come really, really fast. And there's a lot of options on here, including having a anti-scratch, anti-glare, and a blue light filter on these lenses so you have less eye strain when flying your drones. So that's pretty awesome that you can option that out if you wanna buy these. So let's try to install this into my DJI goggles and see how it fits. Now before I do that, I wanna clean the actual lens on my goggles. So once I put these on, there's no fingerprints or smudges on there. All right, so it's as simple as just putting this in, left foot left, right right right. Let's move these IDP adjusters in the center so I can have this thing centered. And there it goes. It went in pretty easily, guys. Let's try the right one, hopefully you can see that. All right, really nice, really, I'm impressed guys. This thing was almost like made for this. Now the cool thing is that this thing here actually has the same color as the actual goggles on here. I've seen some other ones with some bright colors in here, whether it be white or yellow. This is a nice little black or gray color. So it looks really natural in here. It doesn't stick out too much. All right, so let's power on these goggles and see if I notice a difference. The time is here, let's take these off. <laughs> I'm so excited. I can fly things without. Oh my goodness. Let me adjust these IPDs. Oh my goodness. All right. Wow, this thing is clear, dude. Wow. I'm messing around with the IPDs because I don't, I usually fly these things at the maximum outward, you know, uh, adjustment. And with these, I don't really need to go that far. I'm like three quarters of the way there. It looks amazing, balls, amazing. It looks really good. All right, so let's unplug this. That's really cool, guys. Like, I can now don this thing on pretty easy. Not you have to worry about glasses falling off or getting hit or whatever. It's, it's pretty cool, guys. Now, obviously, you can wear contacts if you want to, but this is just a simpler way. Um, I can just put this on and this thing just works, guys. Now let's take a look at the lenses for the DJI goggles too. The new DJI goggles, they actually make them for them. So let's see how these look like and how they differ from the ones from the V2. Obviously you have the same kind of presentation, really, really nice. With your microfiber cleaning cloth. You have your carry case in here, which is really nice, even an added touch on here. It's kind of like of an overkill how much protection they put in here, but the presentation here is really nice and that's indicative of what you're getting. A really good product, a really good looking quality item. So let's unzip this and see what's inside. Should be the same thing as well. And here's your VR lens adapter. And I said, guys, they make these for other products as well besides just, you know, DJI goggles. And here you go, left and right again. But let's see how these differ from the V2s. Put that on here. Oh, another, 
another protection on here. So these guys are taking some really good precaution in protecting your lenses. Obviously, any kind of scratch on this would show up. And like I said, guys, you have different materials you can add to this, whether it be anti-scratch or blue light filter um, or glare reduction, it's all in here. So I don't want to mistake them. This one is the right one. All right, now this one here is labeled as well. It says left and it also says top. Okay, so now these goes into that little holder that comes with your goggles for the goggles too. It's a circular frame. You can just unscrew it, take it off, insert these in there and then put it back together and then you'll have your actual lenses. That's why it doesn't have the framing. It's just the goggles or just the, that's why these are just the lens on here. Now there's also an orientation up here as it says top and it says left, left for the left eye and then top, this is gonna be the top of the lens like this. And I'm assuming this is gonna say top and right as well, which I can see it does say that, but that's pretty cool that they have that on there. So once my goggles comes in the mail, these are going on for sure. Now you're probably wondering why would I need these for your actual goggles too, because those things have a pretty decent adjustment on them. Well, if you have really bad eyesight or you really wanna customize it or the adjustment isn't in the range of your eyesight, then you can get these prescribed for your eyes. Now, all it is that you put the correction to zero, add these to the actual lenses or the actual original lens for your goggles and these will correct the vision to your specifications. So you're probably saying, why should I get these lenses? You know, these DJI goggles were made to accommodate glasses. I do agree with that. As I mentioned in the introduction, this thing is a have to put up and down. Sometimes I will nick my glasses, it'll fall off, fall off my nose. Uh, but there are some added benefits to having these lenses, guys. Now, it's no secret that these DJI goggles V2 have a really weird, you know, fitment on everyone's face. Now, this is a very subjective thing, but in my case, yes, when I put these things on, there are tons and tons of light leaks. And you're probably screaming to me right now, well, just buy some foam inserts. Well, actually, I have done that in the past. I've actually bought these, installed them completely on here, saying, yes, I get a new, more comfortable fit on here. And then I put this to my face and boom, these are not compatible with glasses. So, and that's true for a lot of the foams out there. If you put these on here, then you no longer have the benefit or the width to accommodate your glasses. And that's why I had to reinstall the original foam plate on here. And as you can see, it's actually kind of torn because I tried to rip it off and put it back on there. So now the fact that I don't really need my glasses to fly this, I can now really install these, put them on my face without my glasses, and I'm gonna have a tight, comfortable seal on my face. So let's see how that works. Take it off. Boom. All right, and then you have a piece here for the nose. I'll put that on a little bit later. But let's take this off. I no longer need it. Oh man, this thing is dark. No light leaks at all, even without the nose piece on there actually, I may be fine without it. So with these Hans VR lenses on here, I no longer need my glasses, and now I can have a more comfortable fit with less light leaks. So there's a lot more benefits than just not being able to use your glasses. So what do you think about these Hans VR lenses? Is this something that you're interested in? Is this something that you never knew about? Does this open your eyes and give you more options like these foam inserts or just be able to see very, very clearly, guys? And as I said, they make these for other products as well, like the VR goggles, like the Quest 2 or the PlayStation VR goggles. There's also some other goggles on there as well. These guys make a lot of products for your consumer needs. Heck, for all we know, if this thing catches on, they might actually make some lenses for the upcoming HD Zero goggles, as well as the Fat Shark and Walk Snail goggles as well. So anyways, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.